Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If your Windows 11 screen is freezing, you are not alone. There are many reasons why this can happen. Quickly step to fix them, especially if your hardware is working fine. I recently switched from Windows 10 to Windows 11 and didn't face these issues before. Here are the steps that have worked for me. So the step number one, disable windowed optimization feature. As I mentioned in a preview video, Windows 11 introduced a Windows optimization feature that is not available in Windows 10. After disabling these features, I have experienced fever freeze issues while playing Valorant. To disable this feature, simply you need to click on the Windows icon and then click on the settings. Once your settings appear, just on the left side you will find the gaming option, then game mode. And then you will see here the graphic options. Once you are here, there is a option change default graphic settings by default this option is turn off the optimizations for windowed game reduce latency and use advanced feature in compatible games by using clip presentations model you will need to restart your game for changes to take effect so as i said by default this option this feature is turn off but sometimes we optimize uh, windows by watch, watching videos on youtube so in that case might be you turn this option on this feature on so you need to turn it off after disabling this feature i have experienced fever freeze issues while playing valorant now step number two update your graphic drivers make sure to update your graphic drivers outdated drivers are a common cause of screen freezing visit your graphic card manufacturer website or use windows update to get the latest drivers so what you can do here open any browser and right now i'm using nvidia so simply i'm gonna type here the 1060 drivers simply you need to search like this you will get on the exact website on the top and once you click on this it will browse or redirect you on the download drivers page now simply you need to find your product so in my case it's a geforce 1060 now we need to find here the series which is uh, 10 series of course now product uh, 1060 and then operating system i'm using windows 11 so i'm going with windows 11 if you are using windows 10 you need to go with the windows 10 and make sure the architecture matters a lot if you are using 64 bit go with the 64 bit and if you are using the 32 bit then go with the 32 bit um, if you don't know how to know the architecture just right click on your operating uh, this pc then go into the properties once you are here just scroll down a bit you will find here uh, the architecture the system type this means that you are using the 64 bit operating system and, and if there's any x86 or 32 bit operating system which means you are using the third version and 86 or 32 are the same now that's mean x64 based processor means my processor support x64 based so just clearing your concept now uh while downloading softwares you need to focus on your operating system means windows not your processor right and that's it guys simply you need to search click on the search it will give you all the download links and uh, download type should be the grd which means game ready drivers the other one is studio driver if you are an editor you can go with that one otherwise game ready drivers are more perfect now simply you need to click on the download the file size is mentioned over here the language is uh, mentioned over here you can also choose the language by the way it's over here under the download type the language you can choose specific language in my case us is the perfect that's the international everybody knows very well the studio drivers and uh, game ready drivers you need to download the game ready drivers and click on search and download it in my case these drivers are already up to date now step number three fresh your graphic drivers this method is related to updating your drivers in most cases your graphic drivers will automatically refresh when the screen freezes or gets stuck however you can manually refresh it by pressing the control plus shift plus windows plus b this will reset your graphic drivers without restarting your pc so again control shift windows and then simply press b you will hear a beep sound and blinking effect and which means your re uh, screen is now refreshed this will solve your issues these are the solutions that can fix your screen freeze issues the third option often work for me when the screen get frozen 
I have already submitted a ticket on the Microsoft website and hope they will fix this issues as soon as possible. I will keep you updated. That's it for today. See you in the next video. Allah Hafiz. Bye bye.